everybody. We are talking about a day is a drone. Okay, what do we have? We have a drone. This little guy right here. This is the Atom One Micro Drone Indoor Outdoor Wireless Quadrocopter. Six axis gyro keeps the micro drone stable in all conditions. Push button 360 aerial stunts. Three speed settings for beginner to advanced quadrocopter pilot. So it says ages 10 and up. But and she's played with it. Don't tell anybody. And <laughs> she's only four. Shh. So. Alright, so here is the controller. It's pretty small. You can see it fits in the palm of my hand. Oops. Um, it has the left control stick that moves all the way around like this. This is your throttle up and down. Um, this is how you steer it left, right, up and down. And it is also a, I guess, six axis. So it goes all the way around as well. You do have up and down trim and left and right trim that you can adjust. There's the power button. And it takes two AA batteries. So pretty comfortable in your hand, pretty easy to hold and get the hang of. Um, you can get the basic controls. It's still very difficult to control the uh, the drone. Oh, there's also these are also buttons, these sticks. So you just push them down. And this that's how you do a aerial 360s. So you have it up in the air. You push this button, and then the direction you want the 360 to do, and then it will cause the drone to do the aerial 360, and does all the work for you. Um, so that's that. Here is the drone. It is the Atom 1. There we go. Pretty shiny red. They had shiny black and matte black. Matte silver, shiny silver. So they had a, several different um, colors. You can see it has four props. There is the on-off switch right there. It also has a USB. Comes with a USB charger. That on one end has the little tiny proprietary connection to charge it. It takes about 30 minutes to charge and you get about 10 to 15 minutes of fly time. So it comes with extra propellers. These propellers are really easy to replace. You can see this has been banged up quite a bit and these are getting a little weak. But very easy to replace. You just pull them off and there's a little pin there and you just put the new one right on the pin. So again, real easy to replace, but I've never had one fly off um, like mid-flight or anything. So seems to be built pretty well. Um, we've crashed it um, a ton of times, and really, uh, we broke one prop, but um, that's it. So these, like I said, these are getting a little weak, so but um there it is really light you don't have to register this with the faa uh anything over 0.55 of a pound you do but there it is that's what you get you get the little charging cable usb you get a manual shows you how to um basic controls how to adjust the uh, speed because it does have three speed settings uh, we still have it on the slowest one, so you can switch to medium and high speed. We have it on the low speed, which is the default. Not really good enough with it to switch it to the faster speed yet, um, but I do think this is a really good drone to start out with. Um, we bought this at Sam's before Christmas. They had two packs of these for $34, so at that price, it's really hard to beat um, for that price. I think they are about uh, 20 to 30 online each. Um, but I'll put a link down in the description below to where you can find some drones similar to this one if you can't find this one exactly. Um, but I highly recommend this for a starter drone. And I will warn you, these things are a lot of fun. So once you get one like this, you're probably going to want a bigger one. So first you will turn this on and you see it has some white LEDs for the front and red LEDs in the back that's how you can tell when it's in the air which way you're heading so we turn on the controller push up and back now we are synced 
So if you have more than one of these in uh, the same room, you just sync them individually, and then you can fly three, four in the same room and not worry about the frequencies interfering with one another. So now once it's synced, um, the lights are steady. Okay, so the throttle, you push this forward, and you can see it's starting to take off. So to turn it, you can push it at an angle like this, and it'll turn the drone. See? So you can do that while it's in the air, and it'll actually turn the drone one way or the other, depending on which way you turn it. See? So, um, and then this will do the side-to-side -side movement when you do start to fly. See? So you can see it's going, going to the right, because I pushed it to the right. See, watch. See, like this. So you can see it's going to the right. Now if I do it the opposite way, it will go to the left. See? Just like that. What's my... So, again, just like the left and right, if you want it to go forward, you'll push, give it some throttle, and then push forward on the stick over, on the right stick, and it causes it to go forward. And then you do the same, you go backwards. So, that's kind of how these work. was funny, right, mm -hmm. guys in the camera? So I'm like... Go, shoot, shoot. I'm loading these in video. These, they are my helpers. Probably. No, go down. Go up. Go down. Go up. Go down. Because I like that. See that bunny rabbit thing? Okay. Hold on. That's a good idea. Huh? It did a flip, but I didn't get the. I didn't save it. It's going backwards. What the air flip? Whoa! <laughs> See, this is a lot of fun, um, and like I said, it's really durable. Uh, only broke one blade or one propeller. Uh, and I've had it for a couple weeks. So. so, we got it at Sam's. We bought two of them. It was a two-pack, two for $34. So, um, for that price, we really couldn't couldn't go wrong with this. Um, so, uh, like I said, I'm sure... I'm not a drone expert. This is the first drone I've ever had. So, I don't know a lot about them. So, I'm sure there are other ones out there that are better and all that good stuff. But for the price, uh, this is a really good one to start with. I also think that if you fly this outside, it says indoor and outdoor, but I think outdoor would add uh, additional complexity with the wind and stuff. So I think this is a good one to start out indoors um, and on carpet and stuff. If you if you have hardwood, we've we've crashed it several times on our hardwood floors. Haven't really had an issue, but uh, recommend playing with it either on a calm day outside or in a room with carpet. So if you found this video helpful, um, give me a thumbs up subscribe more videos coming soon i'll put a link down in the description below of where you can get this on uh, somewhere on amazon or something or very one similar to this um, but i would check your local sam's club see if they have any so thanks for watching Bye. see ya